And this is funny to me because there was a LinkedIn question like this that ran last year, maybe 1,200 answers. And when I went back and reviewed it, it was, it was almost split. You know, are you born this way? Or are you trained this way? Within your sales team, you'll see the people who show up as leaders right away. And you won't know underneath if you can train or, or develop the skills of others. But the number one piece there is desire. You know, if you have a burning desire, I'm proof that you can do anything you can set your mind to. And uh, good respect for others will get you very far in life. I was in a leadership program once and it ran 90 days and the first meeting we had to choose a leader and one of the gals was lobbying pretty hard for it to be her and I thought oh good someone else is going to do this <laughs> it's not going to be me this time four weeks later when we met the facilitator took us and whiteboarded all of our results it's sort of a scorecard in his head that he laid out on a whiteboard and then he picked people and said, I am going to put you in a corner of the room based on where you showed up as far as leadership. Zero to 25% in this corner, 26 to 50, 51 to 75. Most people fell in the bottom rung, unfortunately. Um, they were kind of split between the bottom two. And there were maybe four or five people from 51 to 26 and then I was standing alone <laughs> in the corner and my physical reaction was to run back um, and, and join the others in the group. The facilitator asked me how that felt and we, we talked through it and leadership is lonely at times. You've got to be really liking who you are and okay with who you are and not need approval from others to be strong at leadership. And when we're training sales managers, it's one of the things I look for is confidence, ability to move forward without a lot of acknowledgement. You know, they say salespeople need to be very autonomous and independent. I think salespeople need a lot of approval and support. I think sales managers need to be able to be very autonomous and, uh, you know, future entrepreneur type people.